All right, a quick update on math here. So math is still holding up over our green support box. It's over the macro 382 at 15. It's up 3.5% almost on the week here. So it's looking good. Potentially a bottom here off of that wick and the support level. So keep it that simple. As long as you're over 15 to 16 pennies, the next couple of stops up and resistance levels to watch, of course, are going to be the first red resistance line here at about 22, 8, 22, so a 20% move. And then, of course, the macro 3, 2 here at 28, and that is a 48 to 49% move. And then once we get math back over that 3, 2, you can be bullish once again to see if this thing's going to start pushing higher to these higher price targets here. And keep in mind, I don't point this out a lot, but uh, on the macro scale or pretty much on every scale, low to the high once you get over the 618 uh, retracement in whatever direction you're going that's where you potentially have a breakout either to the upside or the downside here so once math breaks over 28 you're bullish on it and then once we get over the 618 at 77 that's when you have the potential for a huge breakout uh, to the upside here so just keep that in mind and going from today to make it up to that level of course is a 300 percent move so a 4x to get up to the 618 retracement. So that also could be a good target and a target a lot of people are watching uh, for potential taking profit there. So just keep that in mind. If for any reason this thing tends to break down or the market decides to go in the other direction once again, which in my opinion, I think everything is bottoming out now. Uh, you can see that if we end up dropping back down to about 15, that's a 20% drop. And then any lower than that, then you would have math here drop 43% which a lot of things have done this, but math is still holding over the 618. That is your 786 retracement down here, uh, just to be clear, down here at 10 pennies, uh, 10 and a half pennies there. So that could come into play if we don't start going back up and breaking over some of these resistance prices here. Now, with all that being said, let's move this thing up now to the 786, another potential target people will be watching, this 159, 160 level. So a dollar sixty, an eight and a half X almost would be a good profit taking uh, area for math here and then if we break through the high and we have a huge breakout we do have the 1272 this is our target here the 1.4 billion dollar market cap up to 1275 and that's where you're going to get that 67 x on your investment from today so not bad at all for math here what are your thoughts comment down below none of this is financial advice and i'll see you in the next one peace out